The following news segment is produced for MTN by the Western Ag Network. Now, here's your farm and ranch report from the Montana Ag Network. Welcome back to our farm and ranch news. To reduce reliance on foreign fertilizer and bring down the cost for the nation's farmers and ranchers, USDA launched the Fertilizer Product Expansion Program back in 2022. It provides grants to eligible applicants for expanding domestic manufacturing of fertilizer and nutrient alternatives. Recently, Agriculture Secretary Tom Bilsack announced approval for more Fertilizer Expansion Program recipients. We know uh, that for far too long we have been over-reliant uh, on others to supply the fertilizer necessary for crop production. That's why I'm excited uh, today uh, to make additional announcements in our fertilizer expansion uh, effort. During the American Farm Bureau Convention in Salt Lake City, Vilsack this week announced that there are now a total of 40 U.S. businesses that have received funding to expand the U.S. fertilizer industry. And today uh, we're announcing seven more projects that will receive up to $50 million to expand access to additional fertilizer expand access to, to uh, fertilizer that will lower costs. Excited about the opportunities uh, in the Midwest in particular uh, to see this happen. This will now bring to uh, the total of 40 such projects that we have funded uh, through the USDA. So there's a tremendous opportunity for us to substantially expand access to fertilizer and lower costs for farmers. And many of these projects are farmer owned, which creates yet another profit opportunity another entrepreneurial opportunity. Secretary Vilsack said that there are still 50 other grants waiting in the wings that have not yet been approved, but he is hopeful there will still be funding for those proposals. We'll be right back. 